then see if somebody could make a frame for it, and then install the motor, uh, the V track, the guides. Um, Is this for um, you want a driveway yeah. gate too, yeah. right? Yeah. So this is a motorized gate with Yeah, the... that is going to go in there. Okay. And Very good. Wanna, I see it's uh, cleared out already in here. Sorry? Go ahead. I'm just I'm just you know, commenting on the on the site there. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah, um for that basically that's that's what we need. Uh we want a gate motor with two remotes, safety sensor of course. Um and a frame for the gate that I'll build. And then at the passage uh, entry, I wanted to do an intercom. Right. Um, doesn't have to go through the phone lines. Um, if it's something that you can connect to an app or something like that, that we could open remotely um, with a catch so um, and a sensor so you can open it from, uh, say, your iPhone, if that's possible. There, um, yeah, that is possible. The, the don't technology. Need to do it on the landline, so don't ever answer the landline so I'm afraid if somebody was ringing it we probably wouldn't answer it <laughs> right uh, so basically those were the two things that we were looking to do I'll supply the power to the gate motor um, before it's installed and I'm thinking as you're looking at the from the street looking at the house the gate motor is going to have to go on the right <laughs> so correct um, I want to make sure that there's enough space there and see if I don't have to move a tree uh, I, think, I think it could fit right in here along with the gate where you have your power supply. Okay, good. So, yeah, that's kind of what and, we were and, thinking. And, Mike, is, there's going to be an intercom on the gate as well, right? Or a remote or something? Well, we're going to have two remotes. Two keywords. Yeah, but how if, if Maggie has deliveries, how can we... She, she's going to have to be able to open the gate. Right, and that's why uh, intercom would have a... If someone buzzes it, I think wouldn't that wouldn't we would we get notification on our phones or no? Uh, that, you can. There there are features like that. I'd have to look into it because the technology is just now taking off, and we're starting to use this stuff. So um, we're actually figuring out what works best, and and there's a lot of information on the online too. So uh -huh. um, yeah, we can definitely figure that out. There's wireless. There's Bluetooth. There's Wi-Fi um, entry and there's there's a keyless entry where you walk up close to the the lock with your phone, just like with the remotes with the cars now, and it opens the before you get there and it locks when you walk away. But those are okay. really expensive and we're just getting into that, like I said, but we can figure out a price for all that. So Yeah, I just don't I don't wanna, you know, incur too much cost on the intercom. Um, if anything, I can run a Cat 5 back to my sister-in-law's house. Uh, she lives in the guest house or something, so I could always do that. So, um, um, when you said you're going to build the frames, are you building the frame for the pedestrian gate and the driveway gate? I, I, my thought is I was going to build the gates, and you guys would have to put a frame on them. Hmm. You, know, the you say it works gate. the other way around. You build the frames, and you put the wood on. Yeah. Mike, what are you talking about? They need to and, make the frame. And and we also use metal frame. We don't use wood. Yeah, no, I know you're going to use metal um, tubing, tubing. Like, yes. So it's probably what, inch and a half or two inch? Exactly. Exactly. Right. We make the frame like that, and then we have a, a, a lock area with, uh -huh. built in, you know, for the deadbolts. And then we... Um, what we do is we have the metal frame mounted first and then we come with the pre-prepped boards that are go on there that after you chose your color and all that and then we install the boards after the gate's already been installed. You follow? Yeah, that's yeah. going to create an entirely different look across the driveway than the rest of the fence though, isn't it? Um, it depends on the design that you want on your I think what he's thinking is the same wood going into the, the gate that you guys are building. So you're building, I think what's, what's happening here, you will be building the metal gate and he will be putting in this kind of wood in it. Well, these are two by fours, right? On, the, on yeah. this design that you have out here. And you're probably gonna wanna use one by, one by five and, and a quarter because it's lighter material. 
Are you going to want to use, well, I mean, you can use whatever you want. If you want us to build the frames and install them for you, we can do that. But generally, we have a system in how we build these gates. And it would pretty much, have you looked at the uh, website at all? To, that would pretty much. Uh, no, I've not had a chance to. Okay, well, that would explain, you, could, you would be able to pick out a design there, or you could decide to be, use your own design. Okay. Uh, but we just have to be on the same page with the framing and all that because we generally don't do that. We do okay. it we do it from start to finish. Okay. All right. Well, we can look at the website then and select the date. Um, I guess if that's how you guys work. work or I can uh, I could also just um, screenshot a photo of of the website super quick and send it to you. It only takes 20 seconds. I mean, it's better if you look through there when you get a minute so you get a feel for the different gates. Yeah, I'll look at it. Um, yeah, because my thought was that I was going to do that same bluebird look on the gate and attach it to basically a picture frame, tubular picture frame, uh, that I could give you the dimensions to. Right, okay. We could do that. Well, you could uh, include that stuff in an email, and then we, we could figure out a way to work together on that. Yeah, that'd be great. All okay. Right. All right. So, yeah, essentially that's it. Um, the entry, the passage entry is at the intercom. I'm wondering about if deliveries come. I know, is there is there one that has a keypad as well? Yes. I would recommend that as well, cause, like if a cleaning lady or something comes in and then I think you can you can lock that um, next code out or you can open the code for like 15 minutes at a time or 20 minutes at a time or you know there's a way to uh -huh. okay um, alright yeah I would go that. with that for sure alright cool sounds good anything else? Uh, I think that's it for now I've been uh, documenting this conversation with the video and camera so that I can refer to your um what your inquir inquiries are. Okay, cool. Well, thank you so much. Here, here. Thank you. Sorry, I had to run out. No problem. All no right. problem. All right, Mike, I gotta go. All right. Bye bye. Okay, bye. I'm so sorry. I have to go.